to get off of the bottom when you have your guard. Now, I don't want to be here. This is super dangerous. This is street scenario. Exactly. Gets to the groin. So I want to kind of control the head. Because what's happened is Brittany's going to get distance and I'm locked up here. I don't want to stay here. Okay? Actually, I want Brittany to go away. Somebody laying on top, if you're just going to lay here, and striking is something I don't want in a street fight. Brittany can bite me. I can bite her. I can, I can eye kick gouge her. My cameraman can get behind the camera and kick me in the face. So what I want to do is I want to open my guard up and I'm going to post on this leg. Now, this is the difference between this and MMA. I am not going to just push Brittany's face away. I'm actually going to catch an eye. Okay? I'm going to catch an eye here, and I'm going to post on this foot, which allows my hip to turn onto my right side. From here, I can actually, if you want to come back down again, I can actually grab the ear and pull. I can eye gouge, I can grab hair. This is not the same as MMA. Mainly though, right, thumb right in the eye. I don't want to do too much damage if I'm just trying to get off of the ground, but it just depends on the situation. So I'm here, into the eye, pulsed up onto my right arm, pushing away, pushing onto my left foot, and I'm bringing this around. Okay, from here, I can strike, but I'm getting up to my feet. Does everybody see the difference between this and MMA? <laughs> I don't want to be here. Not only that, Brittany can reach in here and pluck my eye out of my head. Brittany can bite me, Brittany can hit me to the groin. I want to attack, exactly, elbows, I want to attack vital here, onto my side. I'm trying to do this with actually out gouging you. I'm on my left, free and out, and I'm on. So this on the ground. Here, posting onto my right hip, onto my side. This is the gouging hand, this is the pushing way, this is the ripping hand, whatever. And as I start to come up, all the weight on my left, bring it out. A lot of times they're gonna grab your foot, but at least I'm out and I can pull it if I need to. So I wanna control the head, control the arms. I do not want to pull down though to where Brittany can bite me. Not, not, not a good idea. I have to get out of here as soon as possible. Brittany could have a knife, I could have a knife. I know Brittany has a knife for real right now. I don't have to ask, I know it. So as I'm here, into the eyes, in MMA all you're allowed to do is push away. <laughs> real, real fight, right in the eyes. Ear, grab an ear, but I'm getting distance. As I'm getting distance, I'm posting up. This is so hard to do and do slow. I'm posting up on my left. Notice how I then move up here, I'm pushing away. Grab my left leg. This is common, okay? And I can, at least I'm up, and I can actually start to rip away. A really good method on this to fake them out is moving from hip to hip. I don't ever want to be flat on my back. So I can move from my hip here, okay? Protecting myself, moving here, getting distance, finger to the eye, up, out. So Brittany's gonna demonstrate the move. Okay, so first things first, controlling, positioning, head not too far so you can bite. Now you're going to go directly for the eyes or the ear, usually with your thumb. Okay, that's right. So you're pushing away. Now, in MMA, your opponent can resist because you're just using your palm. This is a whole other ball game. You're going right for the eyes. Now you're going to get some distance. Okay, and now you're going to post, exactly, pulling your hip out, getting even more on your right side. Keep stiff arming his face. And remember, in real life scenario, this is going towards his eye. Posting up on your right elbow, okay? Getting most of your weight on your left, getting your hip to your side, and now you're gonna start to work. Chris, give it a little resist, but keep in okay. mind, in real life, this is to your eyes. Okay? Out. Perfect. Keep in posture, and out. Now remember, he just got gouged to the eye, so he's not gonna be in a very good mood to keep fighting. That's just the way it is. You okay? Did you really get gouged in the eye? No, I'm just fine. Oh! <laughs> <laughs>